Hey guys, DJ here, and today we are going to be looking at the new LR that's coming to, I think, Global and JP. I'm not really sure the Dokkan now. I don't really see it going on or anything like that, but we got a new LR Super 17 they'll go over. So yeah, let's see what this guy is going to do. He's probably a GT boss's leader, and I'm going to guess Global will get him too, but we're not too sure yet. So we'll see, we'll see. So if you guys do enjoy the video, make sure you do like if you're new to the channel, subscribe, you know, to the channel. Help us get 150 subs, help us get 200 subs, help us go keep going through the milestones. Make sure you turn the post notifications on as well. And if you enjoyed the video in any way, drop a like. And before we get into today's reaction, I got to play this intro for y'all. Alright, so before we look at the new Super 17 with the GT bosses and Andro another Android leader? Mm, interesting. Let's look at the animation. Let's go. Uh, Super 17. Not my. I don't hate him, but he's not definitely. Excuse me. Not one of my favorite characters. Okay, you got the you got the gun shots. Yes, sir. This man really. I, how strong were these gun shots, bro? Because I just thought it was just bullets, you know. There's an 18 key right here. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. That big. All right. Pause. But that that kick was crazy. He's gonna hit him with that. Okay, okay. I see it in the art. Is it an active skill? Active skill attack? Yeah, there we go. There we go. Flip the hair. Oh, it is. Mm. Yeah, I don't think it's um for global yet. Ooh, okay. Interesting KO screen. Because I don't think Goresh would have made a... A um thing if he was gonna be on JP as well. So um check out the stats and everything. How many categories? He's gonna be just like Super 17. I don't think he's gonna be any different from that. I wish he was like 17 that goes into Super 17. That would be kind of dope. But um yeah, let's just make sure that Global Dokkan has nothing regarding this man. I would have got a notification for it actually. So. Uh, usually Global Dokkan's in my notifications, actually, but he's not right now. Um. Alright, well. Yeah, no. No, they're only, yeah, it's only JP. It's only JP. Alright, well, Super 17 details. Let's see what we got here. <clears throat> Vengeful Ceremony. Super 17. Extreme Tech needs the help. Please have big bad bosses. Don't make this mistake again. Oh my god, they didn't give him big bad bosses again. Let me go on my Dokkan battle right now and see the link difference from this 17 and the AGL one. The AGL one is so good. Uh, Android Assault, Fear and Faith, Fuse Fighter. Yeah. Artificial Life Form shouldn't be there. What is that? Shocking Speed. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. No, he has 8 links there, so artificial life form, just take that away altogether. Fuse Fighter, Nightmare, GT, Fear. They took away Shocking Speed and gave him Legendary Power. Dude, the physical free to play Super 17. Not free to play, he's like off of a, the SR 17s that you can get from banners. He has big bad bosses. Why doesn't. The LR and the Dokkan Festival. I know there's like a link thing, like it's just like Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, where it's just kind of like, um, like whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm trying to be able to, like, there's a lot of links that he should have. But honestly, Android Assault, I feel like you have to keep it. Does the physical 17 have Android? Yeah, you have Android Assault. You need. Just take off Nightmare, probably. Just get rid of Nightmare. Give him big bad bosses, dude. Like, Ugh, that's annoying. Alright, anyway, I'm done playing. GT bosses are Androids category. 4 key HP attack and defense 150. Not bad, not bad. Raise attack for one turn. Causes colossal damage and lowers lowers lower defense. Mega colossal on three. What no! Oh no, his 12 key his super attack effects are very dull. Very dull. Attack and defense 170%. No, no, no nothing. Nothing. That's all I got to say. Is and what were those stats again? He's tech. So, um, those are his base stats. No LR. A rainbow tech unit. Who do I have? That's a tech unit. 
Okay, how about Vegito Blue? He's gonna get another 5,400 on attack. So yeah, he's gonna have good attack, like around 20k. HP is gonna be another 4,000. So yeah, good, good HP and defense, another 5,000 on the 15,000 defense, 15,506 defense. It's pretty good, I think. Um, comparing it to other units, yeah, yeah, it's, it's very good. That's a lot of defense. That's a, a boatload of defense. Rainbowed, man. And then 170% unconditional. And you get additional. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, see, see. Wait, what? Attacking defense 17% per android. No limit. Per target Goku. No limit. Oh, wait. In the same turn? Oh, no, no, never mind. I thought it was team. I was going to say, dude, what? Same turn. And then get an additional attack plus 17% and damage reduction plus 17% after receiving an attack from the end of that turn. I can't say that you never attack it. High chance? That, why? Why? What's the point? I don't, I just give him one key. I don't see why you put a high chance to get one key. Hmm. Only 17% damage reduction. I see why. Because his defense is going to be crazy. He doesn't do anything on his super attack, which is kind of... I mean, it's kind of good. Because, I mean, you just throw him in slot one. After receiving a gain additional attack, plus 17% damage reduction, plus 17%. After receiving an attack from the end of that turn, it makes it. It sound. There's a part of me that makes that's thinking. Is it you get hit and then you, it doesn't activate until the next turn? So now it, it would be kind of pointless. You get it for one turn, but if you get it for that turn and the turn you get hit and then you get it for the next turn after. Not bad. And then his defense is going to be a lot. And then 17% damage reduction with that. It's going to be good. It's going to be good. So, in his active skill, get hit seven times. That's a lot. Or more during the battle. Ultimate damage to the enemy and lowest attack and demons by 17% for one turn. I don't know where you can use this for it to be very good. His It will hit hard because all his damage buffs are already here. But, yeah. GT bosses androids. Um, I don't know. I don't know. This unit, he's very good. I don't want to say he's bad. He's not bad. He's not bad. He's just, he's very boring to me. I don't see. Uh, very boring. Yeah, that's all I got to say is he's boring. I don't, no slander on the unit. The unit's very good. GT bosses. He, don't really necessarily need him. We need him on global. So yeah. So yeah, I'm gonna go um watch hopefully the Dokkan now soon. Mm -hmm. well, I mean, see what's going on now. I'll be streaming that. But yeah, I'll get this video out for you guys. So if you guys have enjoyed, make sure you do a like. Make sure you check out some of the videos that are gonna be popping up on your screen right now. And uh, I'll see you on the next video.